and gents, or peasants, should I say, um, this is my public announcement for this year. So I just wanted to patronise you and um, let you know how badly you've been doing. All right, enough of that nonsense. Let's get cracking. First of all, we have dinner with a twist. With a twist. Oh, this is exciting. Um, pile on the vegetables um, at Christmas, I say. Now the kids have flown the nest. I don't get any complaints. Well, do not think that you should have been piling on the vegetables before they flew the nest. Unless you are actually a bird that's managed to um, become human, because we don't know these days. But thanks for the tip anyway. That's absolutely brilliant. Also have somebody who... Oh, right, here we go. Right, headline. Um, Hear those way... Bells ringing. Yes, away bells ringing. Not sleigh bells. Way bells. Um, this lady is apparently living her best life. Um, I was a real life Christmas pudding. <laughs> well, you know, people are people are marrying trees and all sorts these days. So who knows? And you know, we can all be what we want now. Um, but a festive photo changed everything. Well, um, I don't think it was the festive photo. I think it was probably Photoshop. And whilst you're at it, if you're watching this, um, just um, have a little word with your son and ask him to stop snacking so much as well. So there we are. God, that's funny. We're going into confidential, which, which is usually dilemmas. So they've renamed this. Right. <laughs> this is brilliant. Right, so, headlines. Uh, let the family feuds begin. Hmm, okay. Um, so, we've fallen at the first hurdle, haven't we? Um, I wanted to do Christmas with my partner this year. The first year, just the two of us. However, my mum is kicking up a fuss about me not coming home. What should I do? Right, my bit of advice would be... Um, have them round to yours next Christmas. So don't worry about this one. Um, and then have this. I don't know if I've mentioned the people putting um, scratch cards as um, uh, a part of their place settings. Um, but if you do that, or if you encourage them to do it, you might be able to win enough not to bother ever seeing them again. That's a good bit of advice, I think. I've got an awful confession I slept with my sister's now boyfriend I apparently did it before they got together and he's coming around to the house on Christmas day uh, didn't know what to do well um, well I would say don't don't actually tell her on Christmas Day, and also probably keep your legs together, you old tart. Nothing else in there. I've got a little bit of advice in here. Oh no, it's not. Oh no, it is health advice. Right. Okay. Brace yourselves, guys. Dietary dilemma. With the festive season approaching, I'm worried for my stomach. <laughs> much it is beyond ridiculous now i'm so sick and tired of these people moaning about being fat and they're stuffing their faces with food all over christmas then booking themselves into a gym that they never actually bloody well go to but mind you the gyms are doing well out of it so fair, fair play um but there we go i think that is about all i have to offer um but i will say as a parting note i'd very much like to thank the person who had put the comment um on one of my videos saying i sounded bat shit crazy i i just love it so thank you very much it filled my heart with joy and i tell you what it made me laugh very much so have a very, very good Christmas Day, guys. Take care. Bye. Now, don't be forgetting to like, subscribe, it's free. 
and also comment it's absolutely brilliant thank you